Deaths in Chicago has increased dramatically in the last few years. Today, the city announcing it's taking a new approach to tackling that addiction. WGN's Kelly Davis introduces us to a man who's on the road to recovery and explains how this new resource can help. I was sick and tired of really being sick and tired. Robert Harris has been six years sober after suffering from opioid addiction. It was really frustrating because, like I said, I did not want to do any more of that, you know. But by me being angry and mad because I couldn't get to help that made me keep on doing what I was doing. He says he had to hit rock bottom before turning his life around. He was hospitalized and connected to family guidance centers for treatment. Not realizing that I was slowly killing myself, you know. FGC says in 2020, more than 1,300 people died of an opioid overdose in Chicago. That's a 52% increase over 2019 and the highest number on record in the city. Instead of people running away from it, they're running to it, you know, and, that, and that's, a, that's a shame, you know. And so I've been, in the, I've been in their shoes, so I try to give them a little advice. Today, FGC and the city announced a new pilot program to get people the help they need now. Medication Assisted Recovery, or MAR, involves medicated treatment to help reduce opioid use. There used to be a lot of red tape to access it, but the city is expediting the process. And frankly, when people make that decision to take control of their opioid use disorder, you want them to access that medication now. Chicagoans can now call a city helpline and get routed directly to a prescriber at FGC to start treatment that same day. I'm, I'm hoping and praying that the message that we give and I give, I hope somebody take advantage of it. Robert says without these resources, he wouldn't be here to share his story. It's been a long yet rewarding road to recovery. Who are we? Um, sometimes it's not words to explain, but I, I, I'm joyful, you know, I'm at peace with myself. The MAR Now helpline will be answered 24-7, but you'll only be connected with the provider between the hours of 6 a.m. and 10 p.m. We have that number listed on our website, WGNTV.com. You can also call 311 and the city will connect you that way. I'm Kelly Davis, WGN News.